Pietermaritzburg, Zulu, Umgungunlovu is the capital and second largest city in the province of KwaZulu Natal, South Africa. It was founded in 1838 and is currently governed by the M. Sunduzi local municipality. Its Zulu name Umgungunlovu is the name used for the district municipality. Pietermaritzburg is popularly called Maritzburg in English and Zulu alike, and often informally abbreviated to PMB. It is a regionally important industrial hub, producing aluminium, timber and dairy products, as well as the main economic hub of Umgungunlovu District Municipality. The public sector is a major employer in the city due to the local, district and provincial governments being located here. It is home to many schools and tertiary education institutions, including a campus of the University of KwaZulu-Natal. It had a population of 228,549 in 1991. The current population is estimated at over 600,000 residents, including neighboring townships, and has one of the largest populations of Indian South Africans in South Africa. Topic: History. The city was founded by the Vortrekkers, following the defeat of Dingane at the Battle of Blood River, and was the capital of the short-lived Boer Republic, Natalia. Britain took over Pietermaritzburg in 1843 and it became the seat of the Natal Colony's administration with the first lieutenant governor, Martin West, making it his home. Fort Napier, named after the governor of the Cape Colony, Sir George Thomas Napier, was built to house a garrison. In 1893, Natal received responsibility for their own government and an assembly building was built along with the city hall. On 7 June 1893, while Mahatma Gandhi was on his way to Pretoria, a white man objected to Gandhi's presence in a first-class carriage. Despite Gandhi having a first-class ticket, he was ordered by the conductor to move to the van compartment at the end of the train, he refused, and he was removed from the train at Pietermaritzburg. Shivering through the winter night in the waiting room of the station, Gandhi made the momentous decision to stay on in South Africa and fight the racial discrimination against Indians there. Out of that struggle emerged his unique version of nonviolent resistance, Satyagraha. Today, a bronze statue of Gandhi stands in Church Street, in the city centre. In 1910, when the Union of South Africa was formed, Natal became a province of the Union, and Pietermaritzburg remained the capital. During apartheid, the city was segregated into various sections. 90% of the Indian population was moved to the suburb of Northdale while most of its Zulu inhabitants were moved to the neighboring township of Edendale. Name There exist two interpretations about the origin of the city's name. One is that it was named after Piet Retief and Gert Jarrett Meritz, two Vortrekker leaders. The other is that it was originally named after Piet Retief alone, since his full name was Peter Mauritz Retief. In this interpretation the original name was Peter Mauritz Berg, later transliterated to the current name Jenkins, 1971-11. Retief in fact never reached Peter Meritzburg and was killed by Dingane, successor to Shaka, king of the Zulus. Meritz died of illness on 23 September 1838 near the present-day town of Estcourt, some hundreds of kilometres northwest of Pietermaritzburg. This was after the battle with the Zulus at Blaukrans, and Meritz did not ever reach the Pietermaritzburg area. In 1938, however, the city announced officially that the second element Meritz should also honour Gert Meritz. At the time of the rise of the Zulu Empire, the site that was to become Pietermaritzburg was called Umgungunlovu. This is popularly translated from the Zulu as, place of the elephant, although it could also be translated to mean, the elephant wins. Umgungunlovu is thus thought to be the site of some Zulu king's victory since, elephant, in Lovu, is a name traditionally taken by the Zulu monarch. Legend has it that Shaka had his warriors hunt elephant there to sell the ivory to English traders at Durban, then called Port Natal. Today, the town is still called by its Vortrekker name, although the municipality of which it is part bears the Zulu name. <laughs> University The University of Natal was founded in 1910 as the Natal University College and extended to Durban in 1922. The two campuses were incorporated into the University of Natal in March 1949. 
It became a major voice in the struggle against apartheid and was one of the first universities in the country to provide education to black students. It became the University of KwaZulu-Natal on 1 January 2004. Topic Other historical events The first newspaper in Natal, the Natal Witness now known as The Witness, was published in 1846. The 46 hectare Botanic Gardens were created in 1872 by the Botanic Society of Natal. The City Hall, which is the largest red brick building in the Southern Hemisphere, was destroyed by fire in 1895, but was rebuilt in 1901. It houses the largest pipe organ built by the Sheffield Organ Building Company, Brindley and Foster. The British built a concentration camp here during the Second Boer War to house Boer women and children. During the Second World War, Italian prisoners of war were housed in Pietermaritzburg. During their stay, they built a church, which remains standing as a heritage site today. In 1962, Nelson Mandela was arrested in the nearby town of Howick to the north of Pietermaritzburg. The arrest marked the beginning of Nelson Mandela's 27 years of imprisonment. A small monument has been erected at the location of his arrest. Immediately after his arrest Mandela was taken to the old prison in Pietermaritzburg. After a night in the prison, he was taken to Magistrate J. Byza's office in the old Magistrate's Court building in Commercial Road now Chief Albert Luthuli Road, and was remanded for trial in Johannesburg. <laughs> <laughs> Capital status Prior to 1994, Pietermaritzburg was the capital of Natal Province. Following the first post-apartheid elections in South Africa, as a result of which the Inkatha Freedom Party won a majority in the KwaZulu-Natal provincial government, Pietermaritzburg shared its status as capital of the then newly created province of KwaZulu-Natal with Ulundi. Pietermaritzburg became the legislative capital of the new province, while Ulundi became the administrative capital. The IFP, being strongly Zulu nationalist, desired that Ulundi, the capital of the Zulu Kingdom at the time of its fall to the British in the Anglo-Zulu War, be the post-apartheid capital of the province. Ulundi had also been the capital of the Bantustan KwaZulu, which makes up a portion of modern KwaZulu-Natal. However, Ulundi severely lacked the infrastructure to be an effective seat of government, and the African National Congress ANC and the Democratic Party, the two other strong political parties in the province, among others, called for Pietermaritzburg alone to be the capital. The debate came to an end when the ANC came to power in the province in 2004, and named Pietermaritzburg the sole capital of KwaZulu-Natal. This has resulted in the relocation of several government offices to Pietermaritzburg. This has generally been welcomed as a positive development for the region. Since 2004, progress such as the modernization of several buildings in the city center and a proliferation of retail and housing developments in the suburbs are results of recent investment in the city by both the public and private sectors. Economy <inaudible> 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 Until the late 1990s, the region was renowned for the production of high-quality textile, clothing and footwear products. An example of the latter included the production of Doc Martin shoes. However, these industries have declined in the area due to lower production costs in Asia. Extensive timber plantations and numerous citrus farms surround the city, contributing a significant share of the city's output. The Liberty Group has made major investments in several phases in the region since 2002 with the development of the Liberty Midlands Mall the area's largest shopping center by gross lettable area and its most prestigious and Stay Easy Hotel. Hewlett's aluminium and Willowden cooking oil contributes a substantial part of the region's industrial output. <laughs> Coat of arms The Pietermaritzburg Borough Council assumed a coat of arms in 1861. The shield depicted an elephant standing on grass, and a cross of five stars was placed above the shield. The motto was Umgungunlovu. It is unclear what the original colors were, but by 1910 the shield had been colored blue. By 1931, the council had approved new artwork in which the stars were placed on a radiant sun. The arms were registered with the Natal Provincial Administration in November 1950. 
Many early renditions of the coat of arms, visible on older public building and wrought iron lampposts, features an elephant which is clearly an Asian elephant rather than an African elephant. More recent versions reflect an African elephant. The final version of the arms was granted by the College of Arms in May 1961. It was registered at the Bureau of Heraldry in May 1973. The blazon was, profess azure and vert, over all an elephant statent or, tusked argent i.e. the shield was divided horizontally into blue over green, and displayed a gold elephant with silver tusks. The crest was changed to a blue sun displaying gold and silver stars, and two black wildebeest were added as supporters. Each had a shield on its shoulder, the Dexter supporters' shield displaying the Union Jack and the Sinister supporters the flag of the Natalia Republic. Transport Road Peter Maritzburg is on the N3 highway, the primary route between the harbour city of Durban, some 90 kilometres 56 miles away, and the Pretoria Johannesburg Witwatersrand conurbation. The R33 connects Peter Maritzburg with Lefelale via Greytown, Paul Petersburg, Carolina, Belfast, and Volwater to the northeast, while the R56 connects Peter Maritzburg with Cape Town via Ixopo, Kokstad, M. Thotha, East London, Port Elizabeth, George, and Mossel Bay to the southwest. The R56 road becomes co-signed with the N2 highway at Stafford's Post. Topic Air. The city is served by Pietermaritzburg Airport, which has regular scheduled services to OR Tombo International Airport in Johannesburg and Cape Town International Airport in Cape Town. Topic Rail. Pietermaritzburg Railway Station is served by trains on the Johannesburg Durban and Cape Town Durban routes of Shoshaloza Mail. It has been mooted that the Metrorail commuter rail system be expanded from Cato Ridge to Pietermaritzburg. Topic: <inaudible> <inaudible> Bus. Regular daily bus services connect Pietermaritzburg to other major cities in South Africa. The bus station is located on Burger Street, opposite the McDonald's Center, and it serves major bus companies. Greyhound and Intercape is the most reliable and it operates several round trips from Durban to Johannesburg daily, where Pietermaritzburg is the second to last stop before Durban. Taxis Pietermaritzburg has two types of taxi services, metered taxis and minibus taxis. Unlike in many cities, metered taxis are not allowed to drive around the city to solicit fares and instead must be called and ordered to a specific location. A number of companies service Pietermaritzburg and surrounding areas. These taxis can also be called upon for airport transfers, point-to-point -point pickups and shuttles. Minibus taxis are the standard mode of transport for the majority of the population who cannot afford private vehicles. Integrated Rapid Public Transport IRPT. A bus rapid transit system is currently being developed in Pietermaritzburg. The initial phase would see the development of a west-to-east corridor from Edendale to Northdale. The BRT route will traverse the CBD along Church Street. Geography. <laughs> 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 Topic: Climate. Pietermaritzburg has a humid subtropical climate with distinct wet and dry seasons. Summers are warm and occasionally hot, with frequent rainfall. Winters are dry with high diurnal temperature variation, with light air frosts being possible. Topic: Sport. The Comrades Marathon takes place annually in June between Pietermaritzburg and Durban. It has been run since 1921 and attracts thousands of entrants. 
The start of the race alternates between the two cities. The yearly Amishovashova is a 106 km 66 miles road cycling classic race held since 1986 which starts in Pietermartisburg and finishes in Durban. It is normally held in October. In January there is an annual canoe race, the Ducey Canoe Marathon, from Pietermaritzburg to Durban. The route follows the M. Sunduzi River into the M. Jenny River, through the Valley of a Thousand Hills into the Ananda Dam and from here to the mouth of the M. Jenny River. The Midmar Mile is one of the largest open water swimming events in the world, taking place at Midmar Dam, north of Pietermaritzburg in February every year. It attracts over 16,000 swimmers from around the world. The Harry Guala Stadium is a multipurpose stadium, and is mostly used for football matches. It is the home ground of Premier Soccer League club Maritzburg United. The Pietermaritzburg M. Sunduzi Athletics Stadium is currently being developed. The Pietermaritzburg Oval is considered one of the most picturesque cricket grounds in South Africa, and it hosted two matches during the 2003 Cricket World Cup. Pietermaritzburg Cricket Ground is notable as one of the two grounds used regularly for first-class cricket that have a tree within the boundary the other is St. Lawrence Ground in Canterbury, Kent. Woodburn Stadium is currently used for most club rugby in Pietermaritzburg. The Kershaw Park Tennis Complex is a tennis stadium. The above facilities form the centre of the Pietermaritzburg Sports Precinct. Between December 1953 and November 1981, Pietermaritzburg had an international standard motor racing circuit located on the outskirts of the city. The Roy Hesketh circuit measured 2.902 kilometres The circuit was named after South African driver Roy Hesketh. During its period of operation it hosted rounds of the South African National Drivers' Championship, the Springbok Series and National Formula Atlantic races. The circuit was also like a second home to Mike Halewood. The track was famous for hosting the Easter races as well, a festival of racing over three days. The expansion of the town of Pietermaritzburg eventually led to the redevelopment of the site as a residential and business zone after racing ceased at the end of 1981. The section from Henry's Knee to the top of Beacon still exists, and is undergoing protection from further development as an important piece of Pietermaritzburg's history. From 1948 until 1953 races were held at the 5.5 km miles Alexandra Park Street Circuit on streets within the town of Pietermaritzburg. In 2010, the BMX Racing World Championship took place in the city of Pietermaritzburg between 15 July and 1 August. Former Springbok and World Cup winner Joel Stransky was born in Pietermaritzburg on 16 July 1967, he also matriculated from Maritzburg College. Former South African cricketer Jaunty Rhodes was born in Pietermaritzburg on 27 July 1969, he also attended Merchiston Prep School and later matriculated from Maritzburg College. South African cricketer David Miller was born in Pietermaritzburg on 10 June 1989. The English cricketer Kevin Peterson was born in Pietermaritzburg on 27 June 1980, as was the Springbok cricketer Quan McCarthy. Pietermaritzburg is home to the oldest football soccer club of South Africa and the African continent, Savages FC PMB, founded in 1882. Tourism Some of the many tourist attractions include, the KwaZulu Natal Museum, City Hall, Colonial Buildings, Imperial Hotel, Comrades House and SANBI Botanical Gardens. Some of the many beautiful surrounding areas include, Albert Falls Nature Reserve, Howick Falls, Midmar Public Nature Reserve, Queen's Elizabeth Park and World's View. Education. <inaudible> <inaudible> Schools Allendale Primary School Ashdown Primary School N. Sikayathu Secondary School Alexandra High School Bisley Park Primary School Carter High School Clifton Preparatory School Cordwalls Preparatory School Cowan House Deccan Road Primary School Edendale Technical High School Epworth School 
Eastwood Primary School Eastwood Secondary School Evangelical Seminary of Southern Africa Grace College Haythorne Secondary School Woodlands, Peter Maritzburg Hilton College Heather High School Heritage Academy Karina Secondary School Ladsworth Primary School Lindpark High School Maritzburg College Maritzburg Christian School Maritzburg Muslim School for Girls Murchiston Preparatory School Michael House Northbury Park Secondary School Orient Heights Primary School Pelham Senior Primary School Pietermaritzburg Girls High School Razorthorpe Secondary School Russell High School Scottsville Primary School Seth Mokitimi Methodist Seminary St. Anne's Diocesan College St. Charles College Street John's Diocesan School for Girls St. Joseph's Theological Institute, Cedara Union Bible Institute Union Park Primary School University of KwaZulu-Natal Vortrecker High School The Wycombe Collegiate Haythorne Secondary School Woodlands Primary School Woodlands Secondary School Forest Hill Primary School Razorthorpe School Sealamula High School Topic. Tertiary institutions Pietermaritzburg has a well-developed higher system of public universities. Pietermaritzburg is served by two public universities, University of KwaZulu-Natal and Durban University of Technology. There are also many private and public colleges operating in the city. Some of the larger colleges are, Umgungunlovu Tivit College, Varsity College, and Rosebank College. Topic. Civil society Pietermaritzburg is home to a number of prominent civil society organizations including the Abilali Basemundolo Movement, Groundwork, Sindhi, PACSA, and the KwaZulu Natal Christian Council. Topic. Notable residents Don Armand, rugby player, born the 23rd of September 1988. Cork Ballington, world 250 cc and 350 cc motorcycle champion. Melissa Carlton, Paralympic swimmer who represented Australia. Amod Kasimji, one of the earliest known Indian settlers. Pat Silliers, rugby player, born 1987. Brendan Dedekin, swimmer, born the 14th of February 1976. John Akerold, world 350 cc motorcycle champion. Brett Evans, born the 8th of March 1982, South African football soccer player, attended Merchiston Preparatory School and Maritzburg College and played for Maritzburg City as an amateur. Adrian Furnham, born 1953, British-based organizational and applied psychologist and academic. Tim Gronewald, Derbyshire and Warwickshire cricketer, born the 10th of January 1984. Hayden Griffin, 1943 to 2013, British stage designer. Jonathan Hanley, singer-songwriter, born the 5th of June 1954, originally from Springs, founder of the Radio Rats, who in 1979 had a hit single ZX Dan on Radio 5, now 5 FM. Bessie Head, writer, was born in Pietermaritzburg in 1937. Roy Hesketh, 1915 to 19 September 1944, racing driver and South African Air Force pilot. Butch James, Springbok and Sharks rugby player, attended Maritzburg College from 1994 to 2000. He played for college's third team. Stratford Johns, the 22nd of September 1925 to the 29th of January 2002, popular British stage, film and television actor. Left for Britain in 1948. Peter Johnston, Park Villa FC, born the 1st of September 1970 in Grays Hospital, left PMB in 2004. Charlie Llewellyn, cricketer, born the 29th of September 1876, first non-white Test cricketer for South Africa. 
Clinton Marius, writer, performer, born the 20th of August 1966. Quan McCarthy, fast bowling the Proteus cricketer 1929 to 2000. Phyllis McCarthy, authority on and breeder of Rhodesian Ridgebacks. Cathcart William Methven, 1849 to 1925, painter, engineer and architect. Greg Minar, three-time downhill World Cup champion 2001, 2005, 2008. He was also crowned downhill world champion in 2003. He attended Carter High School. Bryce Moon, born 6 April 1986. South African football soccer player was born in Pietermaritzburg and played for Pirates PMB in his youth. Sean Morgan, lead singer of Seether, is a former resident of Pietermaritzburg and attended both Merchiston Preparatory School and Maritzburg College while he lived there. Alan Patton, author of Cry the Beloved Country, was born in Pietermaritzburg. Kevin Peterson, cricketer, born the 27th of June 1980. Jaunty Rhodes, national cricketer, born the 27th of July 1969. Andrew Dalby, fighter pilot, historian, sportsman, involuntary dog owner, born the 26th of November 1970. Tom Sharp, novelist, who described the city as half the size of a New York cemetery and twice as dead. Peter Leslie Smith, auxiliary bishop for the Archdiocese of Portland in Oregon, born 1958. Guy Spear, value investor, born the 4th of February 1966 in Gray's Hospital. Dale Stewart, bassist of Seether, former resident of Pietermaritzburg. Kevin Vollens, composer, born the 6th of July 1949. Topic: Various Built in 1900, the City Hall was then the largest all-brick building in the Southern Hemisphere. It was declared a national monument in 1969. At 14 meters high, the statue Pegasus adorning the entrance of the Golden Horse Casino was the largest statue of a horse in the world. However, as of July 2010, the statue has been demolished due to internal structural damage. Topic. Twin towns and sister cities Topic. See also Trams in Pietermaritzburg Topic. Notes Topic. Bibliography Topic. External links Official website Pietermaritzburg Pietermaritzburg Tourism Pietermaritzburg News Pietermaritzburg, Pietermaritzburg.